Jan Corla, quite a number uh, of colleagues have raised the issue of the acceleration of the transition to uh, a green economy over the uh, course of question time today. Now, Minister, last December, uh, Dollard unanimously passed a motion that, among other things, called on the government to design a strategy in conjunction with the European Commission to fund and construct an Atlantic electricity interconnector that would plug West Coast renewable electricity directly into the European grid. This would provide large quantities of clean and green electricity to the EU and create tens of thousands of jobs along the western seaboard. This measure would also significantly reduce the cost of electricity for Irish homes providing us with the cheapest electricity in Europe. Minister, to do that, we need to establish an offshore renewable development authority to drive the type of change and strategic thinking that is needed in this country to make this opportunity a reality. And my question to you is, when will the government implement the content of that motion? Minister. Uh, <coughs> thank you, Deputy Nocton, and uh, you are right to identify the area of offshore uh, renewable as one of great uh, potential and that's why the government did pass the legislation and is setting up the new maritime area regulatory body which will early next year assume the full suite of statutory functions and that is in essence to make sure that we have a system that is fit for purpose in relation to licensing and regulating uh, this particular sector uh, and so I'll ask uh, Minister Ryan to come back to you uh, in detail in relation to uh, the Atlantic electricity interconnector uh, that you've suggested. Thank you very much.